All right, now this is some music. Hey, stop. Where are you going? What's going on here? Susie, what are you doing? Who are these people? Don't enter my territory. We agreed. These are workers. They're gonna help me redesign my half. Redesign? Why do you need so many workers? It's not like you're gonna build a palace. How do you know? Maybe it is a palace. Wow! Give me those plans. Hey! Give that back. Stop. You can't cross the line. Well, that's fine. I'm already finished. We're done. Where's our money? Here you go. Thank you. Yeah. Whoa, this is a plan. Now I'll show you how to turn a room into something cooler. I'll make myself a cool house under my bed in no time. Yeah. Ta-da! No workers needed. Although I don't think my pillow's gonna stay up there. What are you doing? That was my idea. You're so mean, thief. It wasn't your idea to put a house under my bed. Don't blame me. Well, mine is way cooler anyways. Yeah, I know. But I needed to do something. See, Jess? Aren't you jealous? I'm very happy here. Actually, I'll make my place cooler. Whoa, a discount on toys. Let's go to the store. <laughs> Hands off, don't touch anything. I can only look. All right, all right. I was just looking. No one's gonna steal toys while I'm on watch. It's a little huggy wuggy. <laughs> Hands off. Sure, I remember. <laughs> Whoa, there's also a big huggy wuggy. Yeah. Well, I don't have much money, but I think I'll solve this problem while the security guard isn't looking. <laughs> ah, what happened? I feel like something went wrong. But what? Hi, what's up? Ah! Ah! A talking toy! Help! I need to get to my secret room. This is awful! I hope nobody finds me here. Oh, now I can relax and have a rest. Hello, little ducky. If you only knew what I just saw. What a wimp for a security guard. <laughs> but I'm not a thief, so I'll leave the money here. I hope this is enough for something. Hey, Susie. Now I have something to put in my house. And it's really cool. It's a huggy wuggy blanket. Yeah, Jess is so weird. Now it's time to decorate the room with posters. And all sorts of cool things. To create a cozy atmosphere. Yeah, I should do that too. Ha <gasps> ha, mine looks cooler than yours. But it won't for long. I think I figured out how to make my room more beautiful. I need to go somewhere. What have you built here? Hello? Dad, can I have a bag? I need a pink bag, not a backpack. Thank you. Thanks. You're so nice. Bye -bye. Wow, this is really nice. This is quite the palace you've built. Oh, who's that? It's just me. The Huggy Wuggy is to defend me from all intruders. Good afternoon. I brought you my essay. Could you please check it out? Sure. And it's about time. Finally, Susie handed in something on time. Look, you must be hungry. Do you want an apple? I just had one lying around. Well, I wouldn't mind. Sorry. Oops. I did that by accident. Next time, be more careful. This is my chance. I need a bigger board. I 
found it. Hey, Susie, where are you? And where's my board? How am I supposed to teach my lessons now? All right, I'm not gonna panic. I know one way to vent out all my emotions. Here we go! Take that, you thief! An apple, huh? Well, here's an apple for you! This is for the board! Ah! Monica! The strong! Jess, now I have something cooler than your posters. I can draw a poster for myself. Look and be jealous. What? Where'd you get that board? And why do you need it? You can't draw anyways. What? How dare you? You can't draw anything. I'm gonna show you. What are you? Uh, uh, a chew! Huh? That really suits you. You look great. Very funny. Now I have to leave because of you. My idea with the board was brilliant. Just look at this huge, cool drawing that I made. Hmm. It's the coolest. Now I just need to put a bunch of different toys all over the room. For example, here, I have a lamp in the shape of a unicorn. You can't get it anymore. It's all sold out. A lamp? Who needs a lamp? <laughs> when I can have a whole string of lights. Look, it's so pretty. Wow, that really does look pretty. What should I do? My unicorn looks pathetic. That's for sure. It doesn't compare to my string of lights. What should I do? I need something cool too. I think I know where to get it. I have a little friend. I'm the Hulk! Angry Hulk smash! Hey, Quentin, can you help me? I need that bear. Can I take it? My bear? But I love it, so no, you can't. No. Why are you so greedy? What if I give you some Nutella? Hey, I may be a kid, but even I understand that that's way too small of a jar for that big bear. You are greedy. What about chips? A big can of Pringles. Yeah, I like oh, wow. chips, but that's not enough. What else no. you got? You want more? Well, what about this big bucket of ice cream? Will that work? Oh yeah, give it to me. Can I take the bear? All right, just give me the ice cream. Hooray! Thanks so much, Quentin. I gotta run. Hey, what's this? Where's the ice cream? So you're trying to trick me. Well, I'll show you what happens when people try to trick Quentin. I need to go to my little house right away. Look, guys, she tricked me. We definitely need to do something about it. Let's draw a mustache on her photo. Haha, <laughs> I'm an evil genius. Serves you right, you liar, Susie. I guess he hasn't realized that I tricked him. And I still got to take the bear. I can finally make myself a real sky. <laughs> yeah. The clouds will glow all different colors. It's so beautiful. Now that's a night light. That's way better than some string of lights. Yogurt. Ordinary water. Well, it was. Now it's super salty water. And carrot juice. Well, girls, are you all ready to try a whole range of flavors today? Good luck. I wonder what I have. Oh, yay. It's something tasty. I think it's yogurt. Yum. Lucky you, Emma. My turn. I can't tell what it is. Oh, is it carrot juice? Am I right? 
Oh, I hope my glass holds something good. Oh, that's salty. <laughs> now I really need a drink. <laughs> that warm-up round was a success. Now it's time to get serious. How about a juice with basil leaves? Sweet creamy Nesquik with marshmallows to boot. And Coca-Cola with a splash of soy sauce? Ugh, let's begin. I'm so nervous this time. Mmm. Mary, I can see you're chomping at the bit. You go first. If you're afraid, just admit it. Oh god, what is that? It's both sweet and salty at the same time, but not in a good way. <laughs> Emma, stop your giggling and get drinking, Missy. Oh, oh, all right. I'm ready. So good. Chocolate milk. Great. I hope no one sprinkled a pound of salt into my cup again. Oh, what a unique taste. Awesome. Don't be jealous. You got your drinks, and I got mine. Time for some refreshing summery beverages. A berry smoothie. Pineapple juice. And chili water. Ew. Things are really heating up in this round. I'm not afraid of anything anymore. But anything could be in there. I just can't. You are such a wuss. I'll try yours. Mmm, yummy. Oh, really? Thanks! What the? Fire! <laughs> Monica, you lied to me! You should really have tried it yourself first. Oh, mine is actually really good. Pineapple juice. All signs point to a tasty drink. Yes, smoothie. Emma, wash yours down with one of ours. No way, I don't believe you anymore. Whatever you say, more for us that way. We can see that our girls love drinks with natural ingredients, and that's why we're certain they'll like this veggie cocktail made up of broccoli, asparagus, and celery. Best way to get those five servings of veg in the day. For a lucky sweet tooth, we have a candy bar milkshake. Let's mix that up and pour it into the right glass. And the cherry on top of this round is fish oil. Something absolutely no one enjoys. All ready? Time to get to it. Cross your fingers for me, guys. I mean, it's not bad. Definitely something super healthy. I'm sure I got a bad one this round. Whoa, I couldn't have been more wrong. It's like chocolate milk, but on delicious steroids. Okay, I'm up. I can do this, and... Oh, what is that? Excuse me, guys. I need to spit this out now. Ugh. Not everybody appreciates a healthy drink, so we can't wait to see what one of you makes of this mix. Tomato juice and beans. More of a soup than anything. And if you dump it into a watermelon, you'll manage to fool everyone. The other two beverages are coconut milk and scalding hot tea. I can smell something fruity. 
Oh my god, who thought watermelon and beans go together? Ugh. What do you know about bad drinks? I have boiling tea. I need something cold now. <laughs> um, I made it clear you shouldn't drink that. Since you two had terrible drinks, mine must be wonderful. Coconut, yum! I've just been transported to a tropical island. Milk, what this all started with. But what if we added Nutella and M&Ms to it? That is going to be a chocolatey home run, don't you think? Chocolate lovers, rejoice. Though it's not the prettiest drink. But the second glass will more than make up for that. Water with bright blue food coloring. A sneaky surprise. Last but not least, we've got pickle brine with a few actual pickles for good measure. Finger looking good, not. Being the bravest of all, I'm ready to start. Hmm, I think it's just plain water. <laughs> <laughs> Mary, uh, it looks like you ate paint. Huh? Whoa, my tongue is blue. How funny. We need to document this. Say cheese. Okay, Emma. Oh, right. Mmm, milk. And triple, triple chocolate. What a dessert. So you two got off easy, but me? Oh, God, that's salty. Give me a sip. Mmm, you weren't kidding. That's to die for. Ice cream and a strawberry milkshake. What could be better? The answer is not a straight lemon juice. I think I'm picking up on a lovely citrusy aroma. Ah, oh, so sour. I think they squeezed a hundred lemons in there. Poor girl. I hope mine's less lip puckering. What did they pour into my glass this time? Ooh, it's creamy ice cream. Okay, my turn already. First a small sip. Ooh, strawberry milk. This is the absolute best. Uh-uh, mine is. What happens when a bartender tries to wow the clientele? some really weird mixtures. Like Fanta and Cheetos, for example. You have to admit, you've never tried anything like that before. Next to that, chicken broth is looking pretty tame. Not to mention plain old orange juice. Welcome to the orange round, one and all. You guys keep wasting time, I'm diving in. Oh, I was wrong to be in such a hurry. This is revolting. Sweet and salty and weirdly grainy. Yeah, you don't look so good. Good luck to me. Mmm, chicken soup. Just like my mom always made me whenever I wasn't feeling good. I was healthy in no time after that. Don't get lost in that nostalgia of yours. Stop with the daydream and snap back to reality. Which is pretty tasty, by the way. I've got fresh orange juice. Here's hoping this next round of drinks will wow you all. Water and garlic. Ugh, that combo will get your attention. Or knock you out, we'll see. Water with caviar. Another super original pairing. Only someone with really refined taste will enjoy that. And to round it all off, apple juice. A classic. If you guys don't mind, I'll start. 
Oh, so much garlic. And here I thought that's something only vampires wouldn't like. Whoa, that stinks. That smell's gonna stick around. I'll try and distract myself by trying mine. Oh, caviar and water isn't my favorite drink. What awaits me after garlic and caviar? Apple juice? Now that's what I call a close call. I think I'll chug this whole glass. Sorry about your drinks, guys. Oh. I wound up with the smallest plate. But I guess it's for the best, since it's a pepper. It's so small, but for some reason I'm still scared. What a nightmare. It's so spicy. Good thing I had water close by. You know, I've got a feeling that my portion is going to be no better. There's only one good thing about it. This pepper really goes well with my outfit. Oh, and I figured out how to make it less spicy. I just eat honey. A lot of honey. Cool. Why didn't I think of that? Well, it's a good start. But I can still feel that spice. Don't worry, there's water left. Thanks, Jess. You've got some firefighting skills. <laughs> I guess I'm the only one left. Oh, it's so much. I wasn't expecting this. I'm not gonna eat it. You don't have a choice. Fine, you talked me into it. I hope I don't burn up. But I might. Oh no, we're out of water. Good thing we've got a fire extinguisher here. I've never been so happy to get covered in foam. Thanks, girls. I want to go first this time. A Kit Kat? That's not so bad. But why is it so little? You can barely see it with the magnifying glass. All right, I'll give it a try. Tasty and sad. That's a dumb combo. <laughs> that means I must have an even bigger Kit Kat waiting for me. Whoa, there's a whole handful of them. Listen, you need to learn to share. Yeah, I don't think so. You already ate yours. It's so good. One bar just doesn't cut it. Looks like you're really into your chocolate. That means you won't see when I swipe a few. Emma, I see what you're doing. You have no proof. And it was worth it. Where'd all my candy bars go? You need to be more careful. Sorry, Katie. I couldn't stop her. Well, I didn't get anything. Loser. It can't be. Here's the Kit Kat. Wow, it's so big. I knew luck would be on my side. I'm gonna need a chainsaw to cut through this. It happened. You can finally try it. And both halves are equally as delicious. Too bad it ran out so fast. <laughs> you should really watch what you eat, Jess. <laughs> Looks like I'm up first again. Hot dogs? That'll come in handy. 
I'm super hungry. There better not be a catch. Mmm, tasty. But something is missing. Ketchup. Let's try it again. So much better. Great idea. I wish I could have a hot dog too. Wow, it's so big. I like this. It looks so tasty. Emma was right. It does taste good. But I'm still gonna add some ketchup. Ah, I got it all over my face. Gotta be more careful, girl. I'll do my best to learn from your mistakes, Jess. Wow, what a huge hot dog. Dreams do come true. Wow. <sighs> my heart's gonna stop. I'm so jealous. You said it's better with ketchup? Then I'll add some more. Gotta cut it in half so it's easier. Mmm, smells so good. Just mouth-watering. This is just too good to be true. I'm gonna add some Tabasco to her hot dog. Nice idea, Jess. Let's see what she has to say about this. Well, that's unusual. I mean, not bad, though. Want some, Jess? Yeah, I'll try. Oh, it's so spicy! <laughs> Yeah, you shouldn't have put Tabasco on it. Finally, it's my turn to start. Looks kind of creepy, actually. This eye could be used as a ping pong ball. Or you could just eat it. Fun and delicious. Not me. Bunch of gummy eyes all at once. They're so yummy. Mmm. Just, just ruined my appetite. Sorry, Emma. I got carried away. What's happening to me? Wow. You've got a bunch of eyes that all open at once. Thank God it's all now over. Yeah, that better not happen to me. Wow, that's a big eye. Wow. It's so heavy. <laughs> Emma, stop scaring us. Sorry, I couldn't resist. Oh no, my teeth are stuck. I'll help you out with that. Ah, oh, I'm falling. I hurt myself. Yeah, that didn't work out so well. I'm up first again. Hooray! Broccoli? Well, that's no fun. I don't want to eat that. Why do I need so much? I can't even imagine how gross that is. Am I going to have to go through the same thing? Oh no, it's even worse than I imagined. <laughs> there must be some way out of this. I got it. How pretty. Wow. Hey, Katie. <gasps> this is for you. So cute. Thanks. Oh. But wait, this is broccoli. <laughs> Returning gifts isn't very polite. Now I'm afraid to think about what I've got coming. Mamma mia. I didn't know veggies could be that big. <laughs> Wish me luck, guys. <laughs> this will come in handy. It's actually not that bad. <laughs> I 
I'm even starting to like it. <laughs> Jess, it looks like you're turning into broccoli yourself. Our friend is broccoli now. Hilaire. 